Hey, what's up, you guys? It has been a hot minute since I've been unboxing stuff. Um, mostly due because just my schedule is a little bit crazy, trying to fit everything in in my life and applying to a few different jobs right now. So I've been trying to focus on that and actually making sure <laughs> that I have a job just for more um, income for me. It just makes me feel more comfortable. And then I've also been waiting for some albums to come in as well as some DVDs and other things that I bought that I splurged on that I probably shouldn't have, but I didn't think I'd get the price that I found them for if I didn't get them then. So I'm going to have to wait for those that should be coming up soon. November is going to be a pretty packed month with um, some albums and stuff. And then I also have a backlog of albums I need to get to, but we'll talk about that later. So this I've been waiting for for months. This is Luna's official membership kit. I think I ordered this in like April or maybe May. I'm not, I don't exactly remember the month, but it's been so long since they had to um, put this back from releasing because they had so many people that signed up. I think they had to make more. So I would show you the front of this box. It has an imprint that says Orbit on it and a design, but first of all, it's covered in this pink tape, which is okay. I love pink. Pink is my favorite color. But it also has my address, and I didn't feel like covering it up, so we're going to go with this way. I already opened the box this way because you guys did not need to see that struggle on camera. So here we go. So I guess we'll start with this first. I think this is... So this is a bag, like one of those zip bags. So it says Luna the World, official first fan club. And then this is the design that the box had on the front of it that it came in. So it's a drawstring type bag. Um, I think I'll just keep it in here for now. And then, oops. so I think this is a card. Just let me look at this real quick. Yep. So I'll show you guys, but I'm going to cover my name and membership number. So this is what it says. So this is a design. When you open it, it's cute. I'm just going to make sure that my name and the official number is, um, covered. So then maybe this will just slip out if I'm lucky. We'll see. Usually I try to take everything out of bubble wrap before I, um, okay, we'll just do it this way. Before I start filming and that's just because, as you can see, I struggle a little bit. Here is the front. It's still in plastic wrap. I like this color change. It has a um, hollow gradient. So depending on the way the light shifts, you'll get a different color rainbow. I like that. And then here is the back. Pretty plain. I'm going to open this real quick. I should have said I was going to open it off camera. There we go. Just because stuff like this. So why I usually have them already taking out of like cling wrap and stuff for my other videos for like normal album unboxings. Is because taking it out of cling wrap and bubble wrap on camera stresses me out. So then here's the side. It says Blockberry Creative. And I feel like I just sent everything flying. I think all the other sides are just... Plain, never mind. This has Luna's logo on it. So I think this side, yeah, this side is also plain. So then it opens from the bottom. Like so. I'm so excited. So when you first open it, you get to this beautiful pink color and then. So I think this is actually like an album. We'll definitely get into this. Let's just unpack everything first. So I think this might lift up. Oh, that's cool how they did that. So then I got a pack of message cards. What else? 
let's look. Oop, it popped out. What is this? So this is just a piece of cardboard. I get sidetracked by everything. A photo book. What looks like... So it looks like my pins that got out of the spot it was supposed to be in. Or maybe if I lift this up, we could see everything even better because that would be an idea. So it looks like it was supposed to be tucked in this way and it just came loose during shipping. But I'll get closer hopefully. Maybe that's better. So it says orbit on there and then this one also says orbit in pink. And then it says notes on it. And then you also get, maybe if I could figure out how to pop this out without breaking it. Because I don't want to break it because for now I think I'll store it all. And then you get a pen. It's pink and it says orbit on the side. Oops, sorry. I'm trying to read this. There's just, it just says um, the pen company on that. So let's get the main kit box out of the way so that we can get to everything else. Okay. What do I want to start with first? I think that is always a question, right? What should we start with first? So let's go through the notebook first since that is what I have out next to me. I don't know if it'll have anything else on it. Here's the front. And the back. I feel like it's just gonna be like, oh, so it's like um, a bullet journal. That's cute. And then I guess we should do the photo book next. Let me work on getting that out. Um, sorry for the like bright orange reflective glare. I am wearing an orange shirt. This was actually supposed to come to me tomorrow, so I was not prepared at all. So this is the front cover of it. Here is the side and the back. So let's get into this. I'm so excited. So this is in blue. Oh, I'm so excited. So I actually didn't get the set of postcards from their first concert, their official debut concert. And I wanted to, so I'm really happy that we get to see this photo shoot because I was so upset that it wasn't actually a concept for their official debut album. Awesome. Chin. So do any of you guys, when you open a new photo book, like you get that fresh photo book? kind of smell. So I also just noticed this. When you go to the logo, there's three of the shapes that are highlighted. So I think they divided this by unit, which would make sense because they did all that pre-debut stuff. Each symbol symbolizes a member from that unit. Get him. So then we're getting into the last subunit, which has the four triangles. I feel like this is going to be a long unboxing, and I don't mean it to be, but it's going to happen. Chew. Go on is next. And Olivia. Since she's the 12th member, then we have some unit shots for the first girl and the last girl, and a member group shot. So then I think I'm going to leave that 
album for last because I'm actually really surprised we got it. So I'll get into the message card set then. So here's the front with the message card pack and the back. So first we have Heejin. You can pause for the messages. I'm sure this is just going to go in order of the girls. Hyunjin. Hasa. Kind of scoot everything up to try to fit all of the message cards in. Yojin. Vivi. Kim Lip. So I'm going to put them on top of each other just because I'm running out of room on my desk. Because my desk is small. Jinso. Yerim. Eve. Chu, who almost actually became my bias for the last subunit, but then Olivia happened. Go on. And Olivia. They're all really cute. So then, we're going to get into this single album, I guess. Like, it's a special album. I did not realize, it says not for sale at the bottom. I did not realize that um, BBC would be doing this. So I like how the cover has a moon. It says for Orbit 1.0. You get a picture of the girl. So here's a track list that's on it. Hopefully my camera focused on that. And then, because I don't want to put it like right on top of the message cards. Here's a CD plate. It's just the white that we usually get for Luna's albums now. So... <laughs> Everything kind of looks like a mess. But that's okay. I don't really have that much time to fix it. So, this is my unboxing of Luna's first official membership kit. I'm really surprised that it came. I didn't think it would come today. So, I'm going to also try to get on a better schedule for uploading and stuff. Like I said, things in life have just been a little bit hectic that have prevented me from doing that. But I do hope you enjoyed this. And thank you so much for watching.